Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Let's Play the Wolf Among Us. Ow! As you can see, I'm feeling very, very wolfy today. We are about to start episode four of The Wolf Among Us. So, let's jump into it. We should get a nice little recap of what's happened in the last episode, in case you didn't watch it. And if you didn't watch it, go back and watch it in my playlist. Can't afford to look human. You're going to the farm. Here we go. Simple as that. Do you have any idea how much it costs to have an entire family in glamour? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. Crane must have taken a shard with him. The open arms. Enjoy your stay. Thanks, Bigby. And thanks for covering for me last time, too. Bigby? How could you do this to me? I guess I finally see you for who you are! Tell me who did it! Just tell me who did it! I know you know! I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? I remember. I remember this now. Uh-huh. This was awesome. <laughs> But, you know... Bloody Mary? Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Well, this is a, a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. Bitch. Out with the old, in with the new. Long live the queen. I don't like her. I don't like her one bit. She kicks a guy when he's down, breaks him the bone out of my arm. Well, actually, I kicked Beast when he was down, so maybe I deserved it. Oh, shit. Bullets are a nasty business. The silver slug deformed and shredded on impact. He'll be okay, though. Hmm? He'll be okay? His internal organs are positively riddled. If I don't extract every single scrap of silver, he's liable to suffer some long term toxicosis. Toxicosis? Easy there. Try not to move. I had that when I was a baby. I didn't. I don't know what that is. We can't oh be man! This way, old boy. I figured I'd be done before you were conscious, but there's little I can do for the pain. Just stay still and let me finish. Swinehart, how bad is it? No, not the worst I've seen, but damn near it. I must say, you're testing even my skills here. Please, uh, Bigby, don't move it. Stop moving, what? Bigby. Look, I'm a bit engaged saving his life at the moment. But if the fractured extremity concerns him that much, he can set it himself. Uh, yeah, let's do that, because that's awesome. Oh my god, dude, that's gross, even in cartoon form. This is so gross. This is so gross. I can't look away. Oh. Did you see his wolf eyes come out there for a second? That shit must have hurt. Hmm. Not bad. That'll do, I suppose. He's lucky to be alive. Dude, that made my stomach weak, man. Keeps going like this. That was gross. He listen to me before. Maybe he'll listen to you. I don't know about that. Well, he should. There are limits to what even I can do. This is the job. Quiet. Just relax. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss White, but perhaps it'd be better if you gave me a few minutes to finish with him. I, I think I should stay, at least until he's out of the woods. Believe me, Bigby couldn't be in better <laughs> hands. 
and I need the space to work, so if you wouldn't mind, we'd appreciate the headroom. Don't worry, Snow. I'll be okay. We'll be down in a moment. Just please, give us the time. Hey, Doc, how much longer? Colin, leave him be. It's finished when it's finished. Because I once watched a vet sew a turtle together in ten minutes flat. Colin, you're not even supposed to be here right now. Oh, really? Where am I supposed to be? I'm here to take care of my friend. W with what? Your hooves? Could you please not distract the doctor while he has my chest cut open? Yes, that would be helpful. <sighs> there. All done. I'm so happy to be Great. playing this game again. I'm so engaged. This I took a little bit of time off from it, but I'm excited. I'm ready to get back into this. And, well, this time, this time was no joke. Eat as many metal shellings as you see fit, but take just one more silver round near your heart, and the only place I'll be visiting you is the morgue. Damn. That's why. You'll be fine for light duty, if he can figure out what that means. He knows what it means. It's just been... An unusual couple of days. I know, but please, don't give him the excuse. His body will eventually give out. Take care of him, please. She's been trying. Well, he'll need rest, I assume. Sleep mostly. Just keep watch. Snow has enough to deal with, Swineheart. I can take care of myself. Clearly. Anyways, guard against, as they say. Miss White, Sheriff. Colin. Swiney. <laughs> Nobody likes Colin. Why are you here, Colin? Should probably so, drink some water, man. How do you, um, feel? It's Big B Snow. He'll be okay. Hell, I've seen him take worse. Not much worse. Don't worry about me, all right? I'll be fine. See? Strong as an oak, this guy. Snow, will you, you remember that? <clears throat> you had us I guess not. worried there for a while. You, uh, you stopped breathing, you know, when you passed out or, or died, I guess. It, um, it kind of scared the hell out of me. I've never seen you like that. And when Swineheart arrived, you know him, he's never worried. And even he thought you were, I don't know. It was just I'm not going to be a dick awful. to Snow White about this. No, I'd never leave you. I think she's got the hots for me. I'm going to play yeah, this up. Yeah, you were really fucked up, man. You look like when you take an action figure and bend its limbs the wrong way. <laughs> Colin. I'm just saying I was worried about him is all. The guy hasn't had a night's rest in days. Well, I'll get some rest when this whole thing is done. What whole thing? What's even happening out there? I mean, do you guys have like a plan or something? And who should I be asking? Should I be worried about the crooked man taking over? Or is Crane still the thing? The crooked man... Bloody Mary, the Tweedles. This is bigger than what I thought it was. Yeah. The crooked man came out of the shadows for a reason. For him to attack us so blatantly like that. He either feels invincible or desperate. Well, if those are my two options, I don't think I'd pick desperate. What do you mean? You traded Crane to save Bigby. I'm just saying. That's not exactly something you do when you're playing with house money. So he called my bluff. It's not like I'm going to let Bloody Mary just murder. It was a split-second decision, and I don't care how it looked. I'd make it again and twice on Sunday. Yeah. Uh, thanks, Snow, for all that back there. No problem. Thanks? You're not pissed that Crane's flown the coop? Or that the crooked man thinks he's got snow under his thumb? What else could Snow do? If she didn't hand him over, my ass would be down the witching well. Crane still would have been taken. Okay, okay, I'll take your word for it. 
All I care about right hey, now Shut up, is Colin. You weren't even there. What do you know? What does the crooked man want out of this? She was trying I to help me. He was just a loan shark, but clearly he's operating in other circles. It can't just be about Crane, right? Getting him out of town? Is this all about the murders? Crane can't be useful to him anymore. So what could this have to do with Faith and Lily? Crane was a puppet, and the crooked man worked the strings. This is all about control of Fabled Town. But then what do prostitutes have to do with it? Lily? And Faith? I don't know how it all works out yet, but I know it does. Somehow. Hmm. The crooked man. Declared war against us last night. I'm gonna kill that crooked man. Don't At you worry that's about what it. I thought. Don't when you worry happened. about it, little snowy but snow now white. I see this war has been going on for years. We just haven't noticed it because our way of doing things is broken. We need to do things the right way. What does that mean, the right way? What do you think I mean? I don't know, but it suspiciously sounds like your way. Bigby's the one on the front lines. You can't give him a leash. He doesn't work that way. Yeah, wait, what do you mean? What is this right way? We haven't been doing a good job. You and I. So, starting now, we do everything cut and dried. By the book, straight as an arrow. Pure as driven snow. I'm not saying I'm the arbiter of- Sure you're not. This town has enough monsters. What happened last night, what you turned into, it can't happen again. We need monsters to fight monsters. Colin, if I really believed that we needed him to lose his flippin' mind at a moment's notice, then that would mean I'd lost all faith in our ability to help this town. Just let that side of you be done, okay? Be done and buried and we can all move on. We were under attack, Snow. What did you expect me to I'm do? trying not to be a dick still, but degrees. I'm going with degrees. my honest I only answers ever here. do what's necessary. Really? Well, if that's the case, please explain to Colin why tearing Dumb's throat out was necessary. Because it was awesome. You can't let up until the fight is finished. He was he was still a threat, and that's all there is to it. Sure. Look, Bigby, I care about how this is done just as much as I care about it getting done. So for that, you want to give him a handicap? Like the bad guys will worry if shit gets sloppy. Everybody wants Bigby to smile and shave and take a shower now and then. Hell, I'm practically the president of the Bigby Don't Be Such a Dick Club. But this is the wrong fucking time to put shackles on him. Relax, Colin. I can speak for myself, okay? He'll get the job done. Just let him do it. I'm going to... I'm going to let you do it, okay? It's just that now that I'm deputy mayor, I need your respect. And also, this, this is all about a little power trip for you. What situation? All unglamored fables starting today have to go and stay at the farm. Oh, give me a fucking break. Are you going to let her talk to me like that? It's been the rule for a reason, Colin. And Bigby knows it's for the best of the town. It keeps everybody out of trouble. And what if a Monday mm. does see me, huh? I'm a pig, not a mouse with a hat and a cane. They know what a pig is. It's not the end of the world. If Snow says that's the way it's gotta be, that's the way it's gotta be. What? Are you kidding me? If you would simply get a glamour. Get a glamour? With what money? You think I can work? I don't even have thumbs. I'm so torn. I don't know what's the right decisions to make. Wolf's residence. That's rude. Oh, Buffkin, what is it? Okay, I'll let him know. Thanks. Guess who's waiting in your office right now? Nerissa. Nerissa. That broad from the pudding and pie? Yes. The pudding and she pie. Told Buffkin that she has something she needs to talk to you about. Number one hooker spot that in that all of Fable Town. You. What do you think that could be? Uh, Bigby's got an admirer. You always do well with the, uh, disenfranchised. She knows something. She's helped me a little with the case. Maybe she has something else. Maybe she does. I should get back to the business office. I've left Buffkin alone for too long taking calls. And I should probably change out of these clothes. 
Probably. Consider the discussion tabled, but not over. Let me know when you're done with Nerissa. Aye, aye, Captain. Yeah, She's I, a piece I don't know. Work. I don't know how I feel hey, about this. You're not really going to send me to the farm, are you? I mean, she seemed real serious about it, but I can still hang out here, right? I don't know. Snow will come around. She's just... You know, the crane thing hit her hard, and she doesn't really know who her friends are right now. Oh, okay. I get it. Don't worry about it. Thanks, Bigby. I don't know how I feel about all this. I don't like that Snow White's trying to boss me around now when I'm the one putting everything out on the line here. I also think Colin should be glamoured. I think all the fables should be glamoured because that's the rule, but... Also, I don't like being told what to do. Do, 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 do. Where are we at here, guys? Alright, we're about 18 minutes in, so let's call that the first part of episode 4 of The Wolf Among Us. Um, it was an interesting introduction. We didn't really get too far into it, but we, we, we laid the groundwork for what will sure to be an interesting episode. Uh, remember, we just have this and then the final episode of The Wolf Among Us. Um, so make sure you hit that subscribe button. You're going to want to mess match miss maybe watch this if i know how to talk to you you're gonna want to watch this you're gonna want to watch all the rest of the episodes of the wolf among us let's play so make sure you subscribe and check that out make sure you guys follow me on twitter at the beast underscore nj and until next time you guys i'll see you very soon hi